Hello, hi, Mr. Nikkei, I understand. What makes you interested in uh, understanding a, a knee sprain? Oh, you're that shoe. That's unbelievable. He broke his shoe with his own foot. So what's a minor knee sprain? You know, you all saw the video, Zion Williamson down, sprained his knee because of some shoe. And in the end, a minor knee sprain is a minor knee sprain. As far as we know, he didn't have a meniscal injury. He didn't have an ACL injury. He probably just contused it, twisted it, um, sprained a ligament, and he is fine as far as we understand it. So. The implications may not be that severe. However, this is Duke. It's already near the end of the season, and this is possibly going to be the number one player draft to the NBA. So a minor sprain that wasn't even his fault, wasn't even another player's fault, it was actually bleep. I did the sound effect again. So you saw the knee model, okay? So a knee sprain could be any of many structures. You've got skin, muscle, tissue, tendons, all of those have been stripped away. You've got uh, the major ligaments here, the lateral collateral, medial collateral, patellar tendon, quadriceps, and then inside you have your ACL and PCL and your menisci. Now, a sprain is typically stretch or could be intimal partial tearing, but as far as Management, a uh, minor sprain is typically taken very lightly to mean maybe you had a little stretch of a ligament here or there. Uh, it could be the one of the small meniscal capsular ligaments. It could be anything. It could be a completely benign MRI and yet he has knee pain and a sprain and he requires a little bit of time to recover from. So in the grand scheme of things, hopefully not a big deal, but We've all had a knee sprain once in a while. It could put you out for a couple weeks, a few days, two weeks, four weeks, season's gone. So I hope you guys step up to the plate because certainly Zion Williamson didn't deserve that fall.